Memorial Day weekend is underway, and the holiday is the unofficial kickoff to what many hope will be another busy summer season. Bart Bedsell is live along Highway 24 tonight, the gateway to the Rockies. And Bart, a busy route there today. Yeah, it's busy actually tonight. Seems like just about every road in town was busy today as thousands hit the road for the holiday weekend. As always, the tourism industry predicts it will be a very active summer, but this year the industry has some data to back that up. Push it back through a little bit. So Push it back towards Dad. Cheyenne Mountain State Park is base camp for the Scott family this weekend. It's far from their first camp out. In fact, it only took about 13 minutes to thread the poles, pitch the tent, and stake it down. It's just nice to be out where it's quiet and peaceful and you can just sit and not hear traffic. This weekend, the state park is full of campers, kids, and cool things to do. In fact, every summer weekend is already booked solid here. The past several years, we've seen a steady increase in our campground um, usage and occupancy, so we are expecting an even busier summer than the last few years. But camping is just one of dozens of destinations this weekend for drivers in what will hopefully be the start of a successful summer for everyone. According to the Convention and Visitors Bureau, the amount of special tax revenue from hotel stays and car rentals through March is up nearly 22 percent compared to last year. And AAA predicts Memorial Day weekend travel will be the second highest ever, due in part to the lowest gas prices in more than a decade. For the Scots, though, the goal is to avoid the crowds. For the most part, we'll stay here. We'll hike, do geocaching if we can figure out how to do that. And take advantage of the spot they had to book two months in advance to claim. One statistic that's not so fun to talk about, Memorial Day weekend is consistently the deadliest on the roads when it comes to drinking and driving. So state patrols trying to bring that those numbers down. They are hosting one of their impaired driver enforcement campaigns and also a click it or ticket campaign this weekend, trying to keep everybody safe on the road this weekend. Live along Highway 24, Bart Bedsell, KRDO, News Channel 13. Now let's